In the most shocking, but also the least shocking news I've ever heard, the Ace family is no more and Catherine and Austin are getting a divorce. It's a mess, so let's get into it. It's been a while since we've heard anything from Austin McBroom or Catherine, and everyone's been wondering what they've been up to. At the end of 2022, they said in 2023, they would be taking a step back from posting and instead focusing on their family and traveling. So the sad news is, which is today's title, how do you say this? This is the last year. I'm like, you say it, like I don't wanna say it. This is the last year that the Ace family will be on YouTube. That sounds weird saying. And while they definitely did take a step back from posting to YouTube, they were still very much online. They took their scams over to a new platform called Kick. Austin was just coming off of trying to have a boxing career and they were mainly now on Snapchat. It's now been seven months since Austin and Catherine last posted to YouTube, and since it's a new year, everyone's been wondering what happened and if they would be coming back. Yes, they weren't getting as many views as they once were, but at the same time, they were still making a very comfortable living from their videos, and it's kind of crazy to just walk away from something like that. One thing that definitely stayed consistent in their lives during this whole break away from the internet was their inability to settle down in a house and just stay there. They continued on with their track record of running into major issues with these big mansions they would get and then having to move. A few months ago, Austin took to Instagram and said, I'm back. For those asking where I've been the last few weeks, I took a beautiful, peaceful mental break from the internet and my phone. I feel refreshed. Oh, and I almost forgot the best part. We moved into the best home we've had yet. New house tour coming soon. But that house tour never came, and instead, rumors started circulating about the possibility of Austin and Catherine being done. Austin wasn't posting pictures with Catherine, they weren't commenting on each other's things, and people grew suspicious. We had people writing, So are you guys not together anymore? I never see Catherine post you at all. Where is Catherine? Where is Catherine? She is missing in these beautiful pictures. But those rumors were quickly put to rest when Catherine commented this on his most recent picture. Once again, that was all the way back in November, and since then, it's been silent. Catherine's been posting a lot of these like inspirational posts about being set free and things along those lines, but that's about it from her. On the other hand, Austin has been finding himself in a little bit of trouble lately. Austin actually got exposed a few weeks ago for messaging girls from O, trying to get them to sign to his agency. One of the girls he messaged actually came out and released all the messages he had sent her, and many people felt like this was gonna be yet another one of his scams. I mean, this is a man that's been exposed time and time again for not paying people, having shady business transactions, being a bad business partner. Why would anyone in their right mind trust him with their money when they're perfectly capable of doing it on their own? It just sounded like one big scam and all the girls that exposed him agreed. So I think people have had some kind of suspicion that something must have been up with the Ace family. And today, we finally got confirmation. Austin and Catherine both posted separate statements announcing that they would be getting a divorce. Austin's statement reads, For this new year, I'll be taking a leap of faith. I've made the hardest decision of my life, the decision to close the book to my marriage. We have mutually agreed to a divorce, but will remain a team when it comes to our kids. We created one of the greatest stories almost a decade together. So many memories, so many accomplishments, but every book comes to an end. And now we'll be writing a new book as separate authors. We both understand that holding on is believing that there's only a past and letting go is knowing that there's a future. And we both are supporting each other's future. The transition is not easy, but we both are making it as easy as it can be for our family. We'll continue to be the best parents to our kids. Separations are difficult and most times messy, but you will see how we push through these difficult times as a unit and keep influencing with love and positivity. With that being said, 2024 will be life-changing for me. I will be dedicated to myself, my kids, my health, my body, my mind, my spirit, and God. 
Thank you to everyone who has supported us through our journey and who will continue to support us moving forward. We are going to need even more of your love and strength during this time. And Catherine also posted a statement which reads, As I start this new year, I will challenge myself in ways that I have never done before. 2024 will be my year of transformative change and with this taking place, one of the steps in my journey is a difficult decision to leave my marriage. We have mutually agreed to a divorce and will part amicably. Our past as a couple have shifted and has created challenges that are irreconcilable. This decision comes with a very heavy heart. As heartbreaking as this is, I also feel liberated. I have spent the past few years prioritizing my children and honoring my commitment to my family, all while I seem to be losing myself and my own personal happiness. Our main priority will be to stay united as parents and continue creating a stable, happy, and loving environment for our children. Thank you to all my supporters for giving me a safe space to be able to use my voice and share our love. I love you all so much and I'm beyond grateful for all the support we've received from you throughout all these years as a couple. And Austin, you're my best friend and that will never change. This is obviously a sad situation considering the fact there's multiple kids involved, but judging by Catherine's comment section, so many people are so happy for her. We had people writing, Congratulations, this was needed for you and the kids. A long time coming, we're here for you. Oh my god, congratulations girl, you can do so much better than him, he's been weighing you down for years. What's that thing Lizzo said? About damn time. Congratulations girl, you deserve all the happiness after that bull And even Jacqueline Hill commented and said, take your time to heal girl, we love you and stand beside you. And like I said, sad situation because of kids being involved, but also probably the best thing Catherine could have ever done. For years now, so many people have been asking Catherine to start her own channel separate from Austin because a lot of the fans were mainly there for Catherine. Many people felt like most of the drama surrounding their family was always caused by Austin and Catherine would be dragged into it because she'd be beside Austin supporting him no matter what. I'm not saying Catherine wasn't equally as responsible for the decisions that they made as a couple that got them into the drama in the first place, but a lot of the times Austin was at the center of it, and that's reflected in the response to their statements. While Catherine is getting tons of messages of support, people are in Austin's comments telling him that he messed up big time. We had people writing, she deserves better. She doesn't deserve to be with a cheating husband. Saw this coming. I feel like she's become very, very spiritual and is trying to find herself. As sad as this is, we all saw it coming. Yes, she deserves a lot better. I mean, if you didn't see this coming, come on. From the scandals to the cheating, we saw this coming for sure. So clearly Catherine is going to come out of this with a lot more support than Austin. Overall, a sad situation, but like the comment said, we all saw it coming. Anyways, guys, let me know what you think about everything down below, and I'll see you next time.